Welcome to Everyday Life and Money Matters. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I just wanted to share with you about Google Sites. Right, so just head over to Google and search for Google Sites. Once you have an account with Google, Google Sites will automatically be able to open. You should see this page. I'm gonna give you a quick tutorial using the blank option. So just select blank. Okay, once the blank template is loaded, it should look like this, right? So you can see that they provide you with a header and give you the options to include the name of your site. They also provide you with some additional tools as to how you can make your site your own, all right? So let's first explore the options available for the header. So there are various header types available. You can have a cover, a large banner, a banner or a title only. So the name of our website. And I'm just gonna use the name of my YouTube channel. And you adjust it to suit. I think I'm going to stick with 36. I like how it looks in one line. There are different options available. If you go through Teams, you can choose the type of theme that you want and color and font style you want for your website. Now, this can be changed at any time. So it is something that you can explore. All right, I think I'm liking the impression look. All right, so I'm gonna use this option. And if you just select enter, you can put an additional statement about your website here. I will just simply put back live. And center it. I'm also going to increase the size slightly. All right, so I like how that looks there. You can also change the image by just Selecting this option here that says change image. If you already have a picture that you want to represent, you can select upload. But for the purpose of this video, I'm just gonna select image and use a random image available on Google or in the gallery. So if you wanna use a gallery and just press select and it will automatically change the look. Jack look more. So I'm just gonna go back on search and type in abstract photos and I'm just going to select another option. All right, right here you have the option of entering your site name. I'm just going to name the site Life and Money Matters. Here you have the option of adding a logo. So you can simply upload your logo if you so choose. And there is also the option of uploading a favor con. That is simply a logo, just like how you're seeing here, that will pop up for your website. My header type, I'm just gonna adjust it to put larger banner. And I'm going to insert some content blocks. This is how your first page would look like with all the content blocks. And you can add all your social media followings to the bottom to ensure that persons are able to see what you are up to and what your website is all about. Let's go on pages, select home, and then 
add new sub page and you name your new sub page and this can be page. And you see immediately the option comes up for the drop down bar to take you to that page. All right. So now we are on that page. So we can again format this to the size that we are looking for. But because I would want to put more information here, I'm going to use the banner option. Then you simply go back into insert. And again, you choose the content blocks that you would want to utilize. So more content, you can select content blocks again. Now in these content blocks, you can also add, upload videos. So let's I'm just going to select how to make money select that and the video will automatically be linked onto your website and again you can simply add the same details that you already have in that video onto this web page likewise you can add another video or another picture whatever you desire if you don't want two blocks again you simply delete one then we can select another page Add a sub page. We want to provide some contact information. Right, you can leave the same banner look again since you're continuing on, or you can choose to put title only. And I'm going to go back to insert and add a content block. So here you can select an image. Select insert. And put that there as well. So anything that can be used for persons to contact you, you can add it to your website. Now, guys, this is just a general overview of the website. If you want to add testimonials or share comments on the website, you simply add an additional content block and you can probably highlight what someone would have said about a video, what someone may be saying about a book you have published, whatever you are seeking to advertise via Google Sites. Now, once you are satisfied with your site, you simply select Publish. Our website is looking right now. It is a fairly simple, clean website. So I hope you have found this video helpful and that you will get started on your website creating journey. Thank you for listening to Everyday Life and Money Matters. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Drop a comment and click that notification bell so you can be alerted of all our videos. Thanks for viewing.